Hello again, everybody. Welcome to the first episode of what I'm calling Oxdoc, the series where I go over new community goals and any interesting events or finds that I just happen to stumble into in Elite Dangerous. Now, this week we've got Alliance putting on a couple of community goals, Space Trees is a few geysers, and interviews with Drew Wager himself. Now, first up this week is the community goals, which, as I said, centered kind of around the Alliance. There's two parts. The first is an Alliance rescue operation, which takes place at Robert's Port in a system called Fedmitch. They are looking for occupied escape pods and wreckage components. And the second part is an Alliance combat operation, which also takes place in the exact same spot in which commanders are asked to turn in bounty vouchers. So, if you guys would be interested in something like that, uh, just head to the FedMitch system, you know, dock up, take the mission, and get going. Next up, we've got Space Trees. Uh, credit goes to an Xbox commander whose name I have given up trying to figure out, but kudos to him for finding these. Um, they are located towards the center of a rather large crater on a planet that's inside one of the systems Ram Toss sent us out to, you know, searching for the Guardian Ruins. You know, the field itself is about, uh, it's about a square and a half kilometer. You know, one and a half square kilometers, give or take, in size. And there are four types of growths that can be found sprouting from various spots on these trees, and each one gives a different grade of material, ranging from the most common all the way up to the most rare. The exact materials seem to be tied to what's already available on the planet, which makes perfect sense. That's how the barnacles work and other things that we've seen before. But also, on this very same planet, Commander Big Papa located a set of rather interesting looking geysers. You know, at the moment, I don't have any video footage of these to show you. Uh, just all I've got is this particular screenshot, but I will be doing Mega Marvels episodes for both of these, so be sure to keep an eye out for those in the next week or so. I'll probably be putting those videos up. And then Drew Wager himself made an appearance on DJ Truthsayer's Twitch stream on Thursday with a rather lengthy interview. There were some very interesting tidbits of info and some intriguing hints about the Elite Dangerous universe in there. So I'm going to have the entire audio from that interview available here on my YouTube channel within the next few days. So keep an eye out for that, so you guys. So if you missed the interview, you can come to my channel and you'll be able to listen to it as well. And Drew Baker is also doing another interview on the Brocast, which is hosted on Josh Hawkins' YouTube channel this upcoming Sunday, the 29th. So be sure to go check that out, and I am going to leave a link to Josh's YouTube channel in the video description below. On that note, that is all I've got for this week, but if there is anything you guys would like to see featured in something like this, do leave me a comment and let me know. Tell me a little bit about it, and if it's something I'd like to have on here, you'll see it come on. Alright, that's all I've got for today, guys. I will see you all next time.